Hi everyone, today I'm delighted to be joined by Judy Cooper, who's Head of Marketing at our client, Evora Edge. So Judy, tell us a little bit about Evora Edge. So Evora Edge is a firm of technical asset management consultants, and we specialise in transitioning existing buildings to net zero carbon. So Judy, what were some of the challenges that you faced which led you to engaging Avery and Brown? So uh, when we first came to you in 2019, I think it was, uh, we were just becoming independent from our former parent company, which was a global sustainability firm. And we essentially had to start from scratch, really, with our own website, really think about who we were as an independent company and brand and what was our unique offer and identity. And what did it feel like while you were experiencing some of these challenges? I think it felt quite vulnerable, actually. We'd gone from the protection of a much larger company with bigger resources to now suddenly being a very small company of only four or five people and without the, the scaffolding of a brand that had kind of lots of resources and a, and a very clear identity and direction for itself. So, so that was a bit scary, but actually it was also quite exciting to, to start that journey of independence and, and discover who we are and who we wanted to be, really. And what was it about our offering in particular which made you choose us over perhaps another agency? So a big factor for us was your expertise in the built environment and the sustainability sector, because as you know, it's a very complex sector. So it can take a lot of time to understand it. And it was really helpful and important for us that, that you, we didn't need to explain it to you, that you already knew it and you understood it uh, and you could see what we, what we had to do. We also trusted you. We'd seen the high quality of your outputs and processes. Uh, and from a personal perspective, I come from a content background. Uh, so you had some key marketing skills that I didn't have and I felt sort of comp was, was very complimentary around branding, and SEO strategies, graphic and website design. And also, I just really liked working with you. It's easy and fun. <laughs> Judy, when did you first realise that our offering was working effectively? So I would say this was quite early on, actually, because in fact, the initial process uh, that we went through together of kind of working through who we were as a brand and our identity, that was actually enormously helpful for us as a business, sort of starting out in, a, in those early days, understanding who we were and who we needed to target and what our unique offer was. So that was actually really, really helpful for our development. Um, I also really appreciated the constant support through the website launch and the social media um, that you always had. You were always there when anything went wrong, sort of fixed it sort of straight away. Uh, we had really good traffic and metrics from the get-go uh, around kind of our website, which was great. Um, and, you know, we're still working with you now. It's just been a really nice relationship. It's been really, really effective for us. You've always understood uh, kind of what our challenges are and uh, tried to work really flexibly and help us achieve that. And Judy, what does life look like now for you now that your original challenges have been solved? So, as mentioned, we are now a 20 strong team. So we started from four or five. So our growth has been really, really strong, which has been great, particularly since you know, two of those years included COVID years. Um, and we've grown from being a straightforward engineering consultancy to now an, an innovative leader in this sector. And we do far more than just engineering for our clients. Um, we punch well above our weight when you think about the size of our company and the clients we work for and our competitors are all really kind of well-established large companies. And I think part of that was because, you know, we did that really effective process of understanding our brand, our identity and understanding what makes us unique and, and how we can meet the challenges of our clients and the immediate challenges they're facing around transitioning their buildings to net zero carbon and maintaining value. And, uh, and that's where we've managed to grow into and really increase our offer. Julie, thanks so much for speaking with me today. And the team and I are really excited about continuing to support Evora Edge into the future.